Hi, I've been asked recently, how do you sharpen an electrode? Um, how do you clean it? So here is a very easy way. And there are a bunch of hacks. The electrode actually, it gets, I'm not sure if you can see it, but it gets gunky. And that is from just oxidation. And all you have to do in between welds every so often is just to clean it. You see the soot that comes off? And that's all you really need. And that minimizes any sort of, minimizes the oxidation when you actually fire. Now, over time, it gets dull and you wanna sharpen it. In fact, this is how long the electrodes come. And here is a new batch. And you can wear it down over time, much like a pencil. The only thing is it doesn't need to be um, cleaned that often or sharpened. What happens when it becomes less sharp, it starts to get dull, is that it doesn't fire with as much um, power. And in previous videos, I have said you could use a Dremel and sanding disc, but if you don't have it, no worries. What, this is just a, a rough nail file. And well, all you have to do, much like sharpening a tool or a knife at a slight angle, let me see. So if it's like here, your angle should be about here, not like this. You just, just take off a little bit and, and you will see that it is starting to sharpen. Okay, so there you go. What I like to do, and this, this is very inexpensive, but you can get these, and I got this for about $2.50. Um, in Arizona, and this is really rough and it can be, it's washable um, and strong. It's black so that you don't see the dark patterns. So for a couple of dollars, that's all you need. And, you know, if you remember those pencils that we used to use a sharpener to sharpen, if every single time you write on it and you sharpen, you're wasting. I would say that, in fact, I might sharpen this once once a week. So use as you need, but it doesn't cost very much. And when you are, when it is sharp, you can use less power. But if you don't, in between sharpening, if you're finding that it is not welding perfectly, just up the power until you do an, the next sharpening. I hope this helps. Um, and the other thing is, thanks very much for supporting me. I'm a wholesaler of premium quality chains and findings for permanent jewelry. You can email me and if there's another question, I might be able to do a video to answer.